if if you're a real friend and a real brother, I should never hit rock bottom. So it's never gonna be a struggle. It's never gonna be a suffer. We should come up connecting, ele what they call it, elevating. Whatever happens with me happens. And then I have a moment with God because I'm mad now because I done sobered up <laughs> to be my, be this vessel. And I finally was like, okay, this is who I am wherever I go to. Because the harder I tried to not be him, the more of him came out. I can't condemn the smoker, the drinker. Which one is better? They all the same. It's an issue. Cat McKenzie said, thank you for speaking the truth. Like, oh, man, and, and I guess that's what's made my brand or my image um, so transcending is my transparency. Like we talked about earlier, I called it the Eminem School of Battle Rap. I'm going to tell you my my trifling so you can never use it against me. I'm going to mm -hmm. be transparent about my struggles, what I've overcome, my failures. For one, to let you know you're not the only one going through and two, just because you're going through don't give you a right or a reason to punk out or be up, as we said earlier. Don't none of us do what we do because of peer pressure. We do it because we like to do it. The Bible says, delight yourself in the Lord. Why do I got to delight myself in the Lord unless I want to really delight myself in certain other things that are not of the Lord? But I got to own those things. So me, right. trying to build, me trying to build this brand and this image when people know me, I didn't want to be that. He wanted them guys. So I owned my transgressions. I owned my troubles. I owned my struggles publicly and privately for the sake of hell. I can't do this by myself. I got a prayer life. God is amazing. I need my misfits, my bros, my, my tribe. I need my sisters. I need them. Like, Cause if I'm really trying to be me all by myself, man, please just, just imagine this, your struggle, your suffering, your, what you call humiliation. Just imagine right. how you would function if you never had a wall, if you never had a pastor Kenny, if you never had a Lee, if you never had your wife, if you never had your kids, remove, no, notice, remove your tribe from your struggle. See how much you, how much more you will be suffering. You know what's so crazy? You speaking on that. We talk about that a lot. You know, we have these family edition talks, right? And we had a conversation about bringing the next person over into the next year with you. If I'm down and you're you're just not involved around, just to, just period. Like you know, what I mean, not not giving like proper advice, not giving yeah. like you know, what I mean, you don't necessarily have to be yeah, struggling got with me, but. You know, <laughs> uplifting. Exactly. You know what I mean? Yeah. If I gotta, if I gotta pick. Listen, if I got people around me and I gotta dust my, pick myself up and dust myself off. Best when I get enough strength on my two feet, I'm going to remove myself from the people Ghost. who watch me suffer. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, yeah. That's what I meant by because, it. because you, especially with the way social media is, hell, they'll go Facebook Live on you because you done tripped and bust your head as opposed <laughs> to brother. Here come the car. They want to record you. They want to record you get hit by the car, then right. pulling you from the car. 